there was much excitement when Meghan Markle married Prince Harry in 2018, with their marriage signaling a new chapter for the royal family. Much has changed since then, just as two years after their nuptials, the couple had quit royal life and set up home in California. Since then, a rift has developed between the Sussexes and the royal family, with Harry and Meghan making repeated attacks on the monarchy, whether in their interview with Oprah, in their Netflix series, or Harry's tell-all memoir, Spare. According to an expert, their constant complaints have turned the American public. US-based royal commentator Lee Cohen has said that the Sussexes once epitomized a modern fairy tale, but that their whining has changed all that, and the US's love affair with the pair has significantly cooled. He further wrote, Harry and Meghan just love to complain, and in America's largely optimistic society, that's a bad look. While some view the couple's openness as a brave stance against institutional rigidity, many others perceive it as ungrateful and divisive. A segment of Americans, particularly those of us who respect and admire the monarchy, find these repeated criticisms disrespectful and unbecoming. So the Sussex's endless narrative of grievance has alienated many who once admired their candor. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex undoubtedly remain two of the most talked about people in the world, but it's often less than favorable. A recent YouGov poll revealed the most and least popular members of the royal family, with Harry and Meghan suffering a major popularity plummet.